Hey guys, I'm at Walmart. I'm gonna do another vegan video. What's vegan? Especially their newer items, along with some of their older ones, so you guys can see if they have what it takes to go vegan. The first thing I came across were these Tofurky lunch meats, $2.97, not bad. And the Light Life hot dogs, the field roast sausages, and the Tofurky sausages here for $3.96 and $4.97. The Chow Field Roast Cheese, which is really good, but that's kind of pricey. And then the Go Veggie Cheese Shreds. Now remember, Go Veggie, if it's in purple, it's vegan. If it's blue, it's not. And I was happy to see that Walmart carries Pretzilla Buns and the Pretzilla Bites. These are all vegan. See that certification right there? And $2.99, not bad. Justin's has a vanilla almond butter here, $6.56. And we have Dave's Killer Breads, which are also delicious. Over here, we found these veggie rice. Uh, we have the sweet potato one, the rice broccoli, and the cauliflower rice. These are all vegan, and there's only one ingredient in each one. These are the olives that I showed in a recent video at Bargain Grocery. It's nice to know they carry them here. And here we have Bonza. If you haven't seen Bonza before, it is a gluten-free chickpea pasta full of protein. You see it's 23 grams there. And they also have this spaghetti, and that's only 288. And Amy's has these vegan soups. Just make sure you're looking at the back. It will be certified vegan. Some of them aren't vegan, but most of them are. The split pea here is one of my favorites, and there is that vegan certification. And moving over, we have the Better Than Bullion. Some of these aren't vegan, but uh, a couple of them are. They're certified vegan. And these are great for soups, noodles, stews. And over here we have the Amy's Chili. I used to eat these a lot when I was in college. I'd have a fresh baguette and I'd be dipping it in those. Delicious. And there are 288 here. Dea Creamy Cheddar Style Mac and Cheese, self-explanatory, 397. I noticed here they labeled these noodle bowls vegan in the top right hand corner there. And this is a yakisoba bowl, soup bowl with noodles and the teriyaki noodle bowl. Both labeled vegan and if you're looking for some soup for two bucks, there you go. Uh, also this spicy Kung Pao noodle bowl, look at that, ready in three minutes, vegan! And this miso noodle bowl, I haven't tried this before but of course it's vegan. 398 and that's all that's in it miso noodles and tofu here we have another one there's the ingredients and another one so there's a few different flavors to choose from here and then we have these free to eat but not free cookies and these are the chocolate chip ones gluten free vegan 397 here we have some sour patch kids and swedish fish and I know a lot of people talk about these, so I just want to mention one thing because I don't think everybody knows. Although there's no animal products in these, the sugar that they use is processed through bone char, but also the distributor Mondelez is a big company that does all kinds of products, including Oreo. They were caught in a huge violation of sanctions for the palm oil industry, which destroyed a lot of rainforest and indigenous life. So I just want people to know that, you know, it's up to you whether you want to still continue to eat these products or not. Uh, nobody's judging you here. I'm uh, just letting you guys know as I would want to know. They got you covered with chocolate chips here. Enjoy life. And then they also have these simply delicious white chocolate chips. And there's the certification for vegan right there. Here's a pretty good deal. $6.22 for a pound of walnuts. I love having walnuts around the house just to snack on or cook with. And here they have some different sugars that are vegan. Now the Domino's is gonna vary depending on where you live. If you look at the back of the bag or box and your distributor is from Louisiana or California, it is processed through bone char. All the rest are good. Here the Sun Food Superfood is vegan and it's really expensive. And then Soylent is a meal replacer and it's in a drink form and it's here at Walmart for $3.48. Hippies, of course course hippies three bucks oh they have the vegan magnum non-dairy ice cream bars these are really good uh, I have never had this flavor and I've only seen these in one other store price chopper so they have them vegan certified and rainforest approved certified cocoa okay these are new never seen them before the culture Republic non-dairy probiotic ice cream uh, the coconut and ginger, it is vegan. Yes, those natural flavors and the monoglycerides are all vegan. I looked it up. Uh, butterscotch and peanuts, vegan. And of course, Ben and Jerry's cookie dough, non-dairy. And Halo Top even has a few of them over here too. 
And then these are the dark chocolate chip waffles that I was thinking of in my Wegmans video. I couldn't think of the name of it, Nature's Path. And they have a couple different flavors. They have a wide variety of the Daya Pizza Cheese Lovers, the Fire Roasted Vegetables, gluten-free, uh, the Supreme, $6.94. Kind of expensive, but cheaper than I've seen them in other places. Uh, the pepperoni one, vegan pepperoni, of course. Uh, the vegan meatless meat lovers. And then my favorite, margarita. And they also carry these Siete almond flour tortillas. These are so good, but they're so expensive. And the cassava flour ones, but these are cheaper than I've seen them in other places. Uh, Ezekiel bread, and they have a ton of different milks. They got the planet oat milk. Three th they got the Oatly, my favorite, my personal favorite. They only had the chocolate and the barista though. Here's the barista I hear This is really, really good in uh, coffee as a creamer. Um, but I don't know because I don't drink coffee. And then they have the Muala, 478, the Silk, a few different flavors there, 298. And then if you're on a budget, they got for $1.82, they got different almond milk there, vanilla, plain. Almond Breeze, they basically got most everything here. Uh, even the rice milk. Times are changing. Country Croc has some plant butter. This is vegan. I kind of wish they would just put vegan on it, but you know, it's a big dairy company that's trying to make vegan products. This, however, has vegan on it. 328. Country Croc has another one, the olive oil one. It does say dairy free and all that, but you know, just put that, put that vegan on there. Earth Balance, of course, always vegan. And now we have the bitchin' sauce. This stuff is great. I haven't been able to find it in most places where I live, but Walmart has it. Uh, cilantro, chili, so good. Good Belly, I have not found this forever. I love this stuff, 344, Walmart has it. And the Hail Mary snacks right here, $4.98. Silk Almond Milk Yogurt, plain. All they had was plain though, they didn't have any flavors. Yeah, you know, we're just walking through Walmart here, finding all the vegan things. Uh, they definitely have a bunch of stuff here, like this vegan frappuccino. And that's right, we have the vegan frappuccino here by Starbucks. You have to look for the almond milk base one. And they do have a couple different flavors, it's 268, and they have mocha and vanilla. I've never had it, let me know how it tastes. And this is the deodorant that I choose. It's quite pricey, but it's it works, and it's vegan, and it doesn't have all that bad stuff in it. All right, you saw it first. So if you go to Walmart, you can definitely get vegan. It's pretty affordable. You can definitely shop here as a vegan if you can't find another store. They got a lot of vegan options here, and um, I hope that helps you guys out. As always, hope you guys like this video. Thumbs up, subscribe, hit the little bell for notifications, and see you guys next time. And I want to give a shout out to my patrons, past and present. Your support helps me continue to do what I do on this channel, and I appreciate each and every one of you. Mm -hmm.